Welcome everyone, in order to access iPhone backup files on your PC I'm going to have this Apple website in the description and you're going to scroll all the way down until you see search for the backup folder and so from here we're going to first of all copy this the percent app data so we're going to copy this one and we're going to go to the search here uh, you may have to click the windows button before you see the search and in the search we're going to paste that percent app data and then we should see the file folder and so we're going to click into this one and so from here let's move this to the side uh, we need to see what we're looking for so if we got into the percent app data then we're going to look for apple computer and if we don't see apple computer here make sure you do scroll around first then you're going to search for user profile and then go into the user profile folder instead so either click on apple or apple computer and then from here we're going to find mobile sync and then we're going to find backup and now you can see all of your backups here so this unique numbers and sometimes letters this is the unique device identifier for your devices and uh, if you see the date modified you can click on this to view the most recent backups if you'd like and if you double click into this folder and you scroll all the way down there should be this file which says info.plist you can see right here and when I open this it's going to look you know, beautiful but if it looks like really weird to you you may need to uh, get a plist editor so we're going to right click this file and we're going to open with and so i'm just going to use the notepad here and the plist opens up and so you can see it's looking you know weird but the important part is if we go to edit and then find you can look for things like the software version so if i just search up 16 Let's go 16. And if we scroll down here, we can see things like the Apple ID. And uh, let's go further down. Go further down. What the? I do. What? Wait, wait. Yeah, that's the info. Oh, we have to edit this one and so let's double click into a folder here and you do need to use a iphone you know uh, uh backup viewer in order to view these files otherwise everything is going to be gibberish okay so you will need to use third party software for that but once you have this backup here you could copy it and you could move it to your external hard drive or in my case i go out here and i just go to the properties you can see this one is using up a ton of storage 567 gig is being used up by this backup folder so maybe you know i'm just going to go through and i'm probably going to delete some of these backups that i'm not using anymore with that being said, if you'd like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye-bye.